Hey guys, my name is Simpsy. How are you all doing? Welcome back to some more Total War Call of Warhammer. We're playing as the Empire, so let's get straight back into the campaign. If you haven't gone and watched the last episode, highly recommend you do. We had our first battle against the Orcs, and it was a, well, it was a pretty make or break battle, to be perfectly honest. Kurt Reich Marshall. Uh, managed to defeat them on the field. We managed to kill their trolls, which had like 30 attack and 30 defense, but... Yeah, basically left straight off from where the last episode left. We currently have 54 in the bank, uh, 1,000 still, simply because we want to bribe uh, our allies here to give us Kemper bad. But however, those funds are going to go straight into repairing the units we just lost. So I guess we might as well get some halberdiers and get some decent sort of units. Even though those spearmen carried most of us. But we might as well get a sort of decent army here. How much is the upkeep though? 300. Quite expensive. But we're going to need it because... No battle is ever yeah, this could cause a bit of a problem if we're not careful. Broken bow, but we defeated a full stack here with our weaker of the two armies, which I'm happy about. But Carl Franz is not in range just yet. Still continuing to push against the Beastmen, but now we've been preoccupied with the uh, green skin incursion. So we'll quickly do a save because this game is prone to crashes. I've only had one so far, so uh, touch wood that we can continue. But let's end the turn here. And see how we go. But guys, if you are enjoying the Total War Call of Warhammer campaign, like and subscribe if you haven't already. would really much appreciate it. And if you want to download Call of Warhammer and play for yourself, all you need is Medieval Total War and Medieval Total War Kingdoms. And then just follow the simple download links in the description below. So, okay, it's a 2 to 7 ratio. We are defending the city. Right. Oh, at least they don't have any trolls, but they do have those boars. They did fantastically. Their archers did uh, quite well as as well. Orc destroyers, orc big units, right? Okay, so I want allow I want to I want to control the army. Uh, Seeing that, I think there's four units in this other. Then I've got like just under I don't know half a stack. Mind you, all the units aren't fully sort of. <laughs> replenished. I have one unit in this, the town square, so let's fight this on the field. Have a bad feeling. But uh, if we can win, I will be happy. The thing is, you have to hold these settlements for a certain amount of time. That's the thing, a certain amount of turn. So if we lose it, does it reset? Or I'm not entirely sure. We'll just have to find out. That that would be the uh, the inclination. So let's fall just pace. Well, there's not much we can do. They are coming at us with... One tower. Wow. Okay, right. Haven't ob obviously actually seen a siege tower yet. Interesting sort of battering ram, but here are the orcs. We fought them at night last time. So we got some nice little shots. Of I think them looking on the boars look the best. They look so cool. Just like they're so big they barely fit on the boars. <laughs> Nice, he's done. Alright, to battle. My reinforcements are coming in. Surely, but slowly. We're just going to have to hopefully hold... Uh, well, maybe I should be trying to hold the town square instead of the gateway just here. Not entirely sure, but they're, they're, we're slowly coming in, but it's just taking... Not yeah, taking too long, right? Got my some units coming in here, but we just need to get there. Um, I'm gonna get my pikemen here to move up their pikes. The general unit has pikes there, but we'll be able to move him up. But run, come on, you bastards! We need to get there, and we need to get there now. Come on, how are we going on the other side? Just here. We need to hit them before they engage my unit, which always already seems to be a bit of a problem. Come on. Chop, chop. 
group them up so it's easier to see. But it already seems uh, too late, seeing as we're, where we've been deployed. But the orcs are slowly getting up into the tower. We haven't taken a single orc out. I was curious to see if we could. Get everyone that's like a in halberdier formation to get out of it. Okay, looks like we're being engaged there. Just fall everyone up on this right. What's happening on the left flank here? Yeah, not as bad. Oh, I wish I could get this pike unit, this mercenary captain, bloody one eye here, to get out of pike formation so he can move a lot quicker. Right, how's my men going? Right, they've broken through the tower. They're putting in their black orcs first. Yeah, I think it might be sort of a... a little bit too late, to be honest. My, my cavalry will get in here, but they're not going to be able to do much on their own. The gateway has been lost. And maybe the battle along with it. My brave swordsmen are holding on. We just need to get into some sort of position. Come on. Maybe moving my generals up a bit. Maybe could just, I don't know, cause a distraction. We will be able to eliminate their... Their cavalry, well, their cavalry unit, their boar unit, essentially, because we have decent pikemen here. So let's engage them. Right, nearly here. Rather you up there, All right? And then we'll go with our gunners and. You know, it's a crossbowman, but this army is obviously heavily weakened after the fight. 28 left. A noble je death. General Jens has died. They're still trying to batter down the gateway, I think. I'm not really too sure what, he, <laughs> what they're doing entirely. 2% to 4. How far are the mortars and stuff away? Oh, yeah, not quite. Oh god, what do we got here? Goblin shamans. I didn't even see that. That can't be good, regardless. Right, well, it looks like... We're going to be able to hit these heavy... ...boar units from behind. If we can get in close enough, I'll deploy the pikes and we've got to just absolutely run through them. But, they're getting into the town square. I need to keep an eye out on that. Going to Pikes. Let's get in there. Right, what's happening over on this side here? Missile units. Or I'll just get the cavalry to run them down then. Fall you bastards in. How are the Pikes going? They should be tearing through them. I right, get the cavalry to run down their missile it's units. Get the halberdiers what we have. All right, let's hit them. Are they trying to push into the town square, or what are they doing? Looks like they're just holding back here, which is good for me. I don't particularly mind. 
We are slowly killing them. Let's try to run them down there. My mortars must be in range soon. Soon. We'll try hit the uh, the shaman just there. Right. Cannons wise, maybe we'll just try hit. Not entirely sure, just maybe there. The units just there. We are engaging them. I don't know why the uh, <laughs> the others aren't really doing anything. All right, let's get my crossbowmen and my gunners. Where can I put my gunners? Maybe just here. Go on a loose formation, go there. All right, crossbowmen can go in the gap just here if we can. How's my general unit running down the missiles? I'm going to keep my general unit in the town square because for some reason they're just sort of I'm not entirely sure. They are pushing their men in up and over into the city. They just haven't taken the the gateway down and they're just sitting flat footed which makes no sense whatsoever. But I'm going to go with it. Maybe the medieval AI is being a little bit stupid. It does that from time to time. Right, we broke that unit there. How the pike been going? I've got another unit coming in. Gold will do the job. Your forces are filled with courage and fortune. Okay. Well, let's try to hit them. Looks like the mortars are in range. They might have even got a couple of shots off. Mortars! Make aim. Find your adjustments. Alright, move the gunners up. I hit the shaman. They actually have an artillery unit. That's what it is. I'm assuming he like shoots magic or something out. I think we get magic units at some point. Let's fire at them. Move my halberdiers out of the way. I'll just move them to the. Oh, move them to the yeah, get out of the way. It's actually a test of how much friendly fire actually is in this. I'll get my crossbowmen to hit into the cost of there. Uh, heavy infantry there, right. Are they pushing into the town square now? Yep, slowly, but uh, surely, so we might as well just get these guys into engage. I was going to say, if we can sit back and shoot with my artillery, I will, but it doesn't look like we're going to be able to. So, quickly, men, make ready and try hit the... Uh, the bodyguard there. Let's try to get my general to do some flanking maneuvers if we can. We'll continue to fire our mortars into the cluster there. Might even try for the one further back. Right, these cannons. Move them up if we can. Right, how's the general unit in the town square going? Oh god, I don't like that. Right, get the mortars to hit them. Get these other cannons. I don't know, maybe just try to hit their, them down there. Let's engage their general unit. My other general unit's getting in here. Cavalry, where can I sort of deploy you to help? Any archers or anything nearby that I can sort of hit? We've lost 17% to their 16. Heavily outnumbered, of course. But it looks like they're starting to move their units in. Maybe I could try hit their general bodyguard. Hit them while they're flat-footed a bit here. Alright, we broke that unit. Get out of Helbadir formation. Well, what even is it? Spear wall, rather said. Try run them down. Okay, we'll get my cavalry to hit them here. And then we'll get my cavalry to continue to hit these archers just here. They, pretty, they do pretty well, but it looks like they're all pushing into the town square. Might move my mortars to try hit the town square or, or something. Alright. Let's run them down. On, let's get rid of them. If we can get rid of the general bodyguard, that'll be a bigger victory, to be honest. Alright. Getting rid of the crossbowmen. Who have we got here? Crossbowmen. Fire at that. 
Get the mortars. Cavalry. Yeah, fire at that. Fire in there. That's a pretty clear shot. We might actually be able to hit some. Just get these guys to defeat the general unit. Cannons. Make aim at the target. That should be a pretty easy shot. We better hit a couple of them there. I'm hoping. Theoretically, it looks pretty straight. It's a pretty straight sort of shot. Go on fire before they move. Right, here we go. Yep, we took out a couple of them. Maybe should have gone with like an exploding ammo or something. Arch, uh, cavalry still running them down. Enemy general has fallen. We killed the enemy general, which I'm happy with. Alright, are they starting to take the town square, or what are they doing? Yeah, well, they haven't initiated the countdown. God knows why that hasn't happened. Like I said, we'll go with exploding ammo and see what happens here. Are those shamans still in the field? One unit. Let's start, just, I don't know, sandwiching them or something. Yeah, I don't know if it's very accurate or not. I right, hit them from behind. Start speeding this up a little bit. Building lost. I'm worried to actually see my general. Now, why isn't the countdown being initiated for them? No time limit for the battle. Are they... I genuinely don't know. Why the hell haven't they, like, won just yet? Well, regardless, we'll put my mortars in range where we can start bombarding the town square. We might be able to win this battle, like, uh... After all. Oh, hit them. Get my archers to hit them as well. Yeah, I think the AI is sort of glitching out in this battle. I'm not entirely sure what the hell's going on, but I'm not going to complain, to be honest. If it's being stupid and I can win this, I'll be happy. Yeah, well, because I think it's glitching out on the field there. I don't really know. It's sort of saying that unit isn't there or something. Right, well, the mortars are nearly in range to hit the town square, which I want. Alright, well, let's retake our city. Get out of um, Albedir formation. You're, you two are really uh, ready to uh, rally up together, so let's hit them and hit them hard. Get my crossbowmen to stay there. I'm not really too sure how my cannons are going to go, but... I don't know, maybe. Keep my general units sort of together. But, uh, yeah, let's get into our own city. Get in, get out, and get paid. Let's hit the... Black Orcs. My mortars are continuing to bombard the town square. How are they going? They might be hitting some of my own buildings, but it's a, it's a sacrifice so I'm happy to make. I don't know. <laughs> They've got the town square, but I don't know why they're not being able to take it. It literally makes no sense. They've taken my city. They've won. Uh, but, uh, still... Maybe there was a unit in the town square they couldn't destroy or something. But it looks like their general units engaging mine, so I want to move back. Get this general unit here to hit them. My mortars are nearly out of ammunition, but we really did absolutely fuck most of them inside. Just bombardment after bombardment, so we're out of ammo with them. We do have a cannon left. Maybe we could shoot up and over the wall. I'm not entirely sure if they're going to be in range just there. Oh, these halberdiers aren't particularly working too well. We're going to lose this captain here if we're not careful. And we have. We have most definitely. 
Oh no, he survived. <laughs> oh bloody hell. Um, we're gonna get hit from behind here if we're not careful. Alright, that unit is... Oh, what the fuck? Why didn't they shoot? Just abandon their, uh... Oh, damn it. Well, we'll continue to... Oh, shit. Yeah, well, there go the mortars. There's a unit of heavies just out here that's... Oh, fuck. We don't have a unit to break down. Send a couple of the units back out, maybe. Get the hell of the deer formation and move up in there. I'll ungroup you. Get you guys just to continue. Then maybe we can get some cavalry charges. I'm going to withdraw him. We can't. Alright, let's get my cavalry to start hitting them. Got any abilities that we can use? We broke them. That's good. Finish them off. Get them back in here now. The more we can kill, the better. Right, how's my general going? 43 to 63. Right, get everyone we can in here now. Now oh, maybe we can't withdraw. Maybe we lose the army. Oh shit. Didn't actually see or think of that. The skull, I'm pretty sure the little skull didn't pop up when we deployed. Well, my uh, cavalry should be fine getting rid of the archer units. Get the crossbow guys in here. Well, we're going to be hit from behind quite quickly if we're not careful. Get our halberdiers, the ones we've got left, to go into the formation and hit these guys. Pretty rude flanking maneuver. If we're not careful, we're going to lose the prince in this battle. Maybe I've sort of. Yeah, I'm not really too sure how we can. Oh shit, we're going to lose our generals here if we're not careful. Fuck, I don't think. We're, we're not going to win this. Even though we brought it down to the final wire. They can't, we can't withdraw them. I think it's fight to the death, yeah. Oh. We did kill nearly 70%. Carl Franz will be able to mop up the rest. But, uh, yes, well. There's not much we can do. We can't actually withdraw them, so we're going to have to quit the battle. Yeah, that is so weird why they, well, even we had that extra time. Could suicide them in there, but I, I think we might be better. Maybe we can, I don't know, run away. Let's exit. Yeah, well, there's not much we can do. Close defeat. There was no way those, what is it, five, six, seven, eight units would have done anything, but wow. General Jens deployed 1,214. Lost 1,205 on the field. Nine men remaining. I hope we don't lose Prince Rudolf and um, one of my best generals there. Shit. Bone, a broken bone actually. Deployed 2,299 and lost 1,360 on the field. So we killed as much as they deployed. No. they We killed as much as we deployed. <laughs> The Empire Mortar killed 528, but uh, the Bodyguard 160, 128, but a close defeat, wasn't really expecting to win that, <laughs> but we did suffer some pretty big blows to the, to the Orcs, I just hope I don't lose my, yes, oh, what a shame, ah, oh, shit. Now, well, not only did we lose the settlement, but we've lost our famous general, which I can't fucking remember his name. <laughs> I think it was Kurt, wasn't it? Kurt Reichland. And we've lost Prince Rudolf. Oh, what will happen to Karl Franz now? And a army of beastsmen has arrived at the capital. Whew.
Not good. Not good whatsoever. But we've had some deaths. Oh, no. Uh, we've lost uh, our mercenary captain. My forces melt away. The city was sacked. A noble death. Kurt Reichmarschall. Oh, Prince Rudolf is dead. Oh, no. So we have a new prince now. Prince Otwin. I really do like that, though, winner. I don't know, I like, I like mixing up, so now the line will continue, but... Rudolf Franz died in battle from the Orkish incursion. Oh no, so... Until Rico comes of age, his uncle, Prince Otwin, will uh, inherit the throne. Oh, what a shame, a death in the family. Well, Carl Franz is only going to do one thing. And he's going to declare war eternal upon the orcs. A one to one. Are you serious? The enemy will pay with their blood. Seeing as we have our mortars, we're just going to bombard the absolute fuck out of them. But, yeah, it looks like the beastmen have pushed up over here. We're going to need to continue to get our armies back. We lost a unit of mortars and great cannons. Uh, we're going to continue to get some Empire swordsmen back in, of course. How much can we recruit in these other sort of armies, other sort of settlements? Archers will be all right. We still have 4,500 in the bank, uh, 45,000 in the bank. Because so I still want to take Kemper back, but we're going to retake our settlement. Oh, yeah, that's been taken to 40 turns now. Bloody hell. We can't afford to really lose any settlements. But uh, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you very much for watching. We're going to be paying back the orcs in the next episode. But yeah, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. All my social media links are in the description below. If you want to play Call of Warhammer along with me, all the download links are in the description below. But uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more content on SimC Total War. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.